training center? How can we build a training center in your hospital and in Istanbul? What do um, you think about that? So, because you know there are millions of people suffering from COPD, yeah. from chronic bronchitis, and they need our help. Yeah. But can how can we build this type of training center? Yeah, I think, I think it's a, a very good idea. Um, obviously. It's a technique that you need to learn, but it shouldn't be too difficult. Um, but setting up some sort of, you know, a joint training centre, collaborating between you and us here, would, would be an excellent idea. Um, if we were running the study, then it would be a good opportunity potentially to have a training centre running alongside the study, so that you know we were ready to go afterwards. But we've got a. Um, We've got a very big uh, clinical skills and simulation lab uh, over in the other building that that we use for training people on bronchoscopy and EBUS and things like that. So we could use that sort of facility, and then of course they could come and see cases and potentially get yeah. hands on. Enough operating rooms, enough facilities for this type of training center, uh, because many doctors will come. Yeah, um, outside of UK. So. Um, How can you manage them? So we, I mean, we've got we've got eight theatres upstairs. We've got six cardiac catheter labs. Uh, we're building a whole new imaging centre with three new intervention suites. Um, we've got the bronchoscopy suite over the other side. We've got the training centre, the simulation centre. So we've got the facilities. Yes. It's just booking. You think yeah. we have the facilities? Yes. Yeah. 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 Definitely. I think and it's also very we have also some facilities in Istanbul. Yeah. We can uh, collaborate with each other. Yeah, you could some have people in the of course there, some, of course here. Yeah, some people yeah. here. Yeah. During the study, it will be shaped. You think? Say again. During the study, during our RCT, yeah. we can build yeah. the I other part of the. I think that would be sensible. Center. Yes. Uh, build it alongside the study, so that when when the study is finished, if the results are very good, which I'm sure they will be, then you're ready to go with training people, people doing the procedure, because you would have already had that running alongside the study. Do doctors can touch the patients here or not? Uh, they, they can if they are GMC. Are GMC. 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 So that's our General Medical Council. So if you come from abroad, you can't, yes. you know, sadly they can't can touch a patient. Um, they but can, they can do simulation, simulation animal models. But um, if you, if from the UK or foreign doctors who have GMC registration, yes, yeah, some of them are GMC. They can, yeah, they, they, can, can, they can, they can touch and treat the patients here. Yes, even they don't have their own patients. Yes, as long okay. as they're GMC approved. And also, you can also touch patients in Turkey in Istanbul. Yeah, sure. Okay, thank sure, you. I think it's an exciting opportunity. Thank you.